Hey everybody, this is Jen from Scan and Cut Jam Sessions and Scan and Cut Canvas and Scout Help on Facebook. You have a file that you want both cut and draw. Well, how do you do it? You can't send <clears throat> um, a layer over and think it's all going to be done like at the exact same time. No cutter can do that um, because you know that you have to change um, the blade over to a pen or pen to blade, vice versa, okay? Um, it's actually pretty easy to do um, in Scal. Um, you're going to set your draw file to what you want drawn and cut to what you want cut. So I have this up here. I just threw up something quick. I want the star to be cut, and then I want all the little things on top to be drawn. So you can do this in the machine. Um, leaving the mat in there, you don't have to eject it. Um, in the same file um, that you send over there. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to select the star only. You can come down here in this part to select the star only. Come over here and make sure the cut line type under the wrench icon in the right panel is set to cut. Then come in here, um, select all of your little icons or items in here. Come up here to Object, click Group, which I already have them grouped. So once they're grouped, select them. Come to this wrench icon. Make sure the cut line type is set to Draw. Okay, so let's look at our preview. Awesome. This red star, or this star is red because it's a cut. The Draw line um, is blue. That is perfect. So when I send this file, okay, so let's try this. Where's my little thing? I'm actually going to send mine over via my USB cable. So I don't have to mess around with the stick. I'm going to send it over, oh, I tell you, security system. I'm going to send mine over. I, the, I have the scan and cut too. So I find my removable disk. Send it over. That way. Okay. So there's my test. Um, I'm going to take my camera over and we're going to do part two. So look for part two of the cut and draw file. Thanks guys.